how did it feel, this was like your first meet back after an injury, so how did that feel to compete against Humvee? It felt great. Um, honestly, I've been working really hard in the gym, so it felt great to finally get out there again and just do what I know how to do. I love to compete, so it was a great feeling to me, and I know it was a great feeling to the team as well, so it was really exciting. Definitely. And you placed second, which is pretty good for your first time back, so what kind of improvements are you thinking to make to be you know, at full strength by Big Ten time? Um, well, every tenth matters, so I had a little bit of wobbles, but just go up there, just nail it, just stay tight. Everything that I do is going to count no matter what, so just do the best that I can, and every little detail is going to matter, so. How did you feel about your performance tonight? Um, I felt really good. I felt confident out there. Um, I just wanted to go out there and hit all four events, and I did, and definitely going to build on that for next week and the weeks to come. Mm -hmm. um, and so how was it competing against Penn State? Because they're somebody you're going to see again at the Big Ten Championships. So. Um, it felt good. I treated them just like any other team out there. Um, kind of just treated like practice too. Like just kind of blocked them out and just focused on what I was doing and what the team was doing and just stayed in our level. Definitely. Um, and then what, uh, what kind of improvements are you kind of thinking of making as you go towards the Big Ten? Um, definitely. Uh, watch my landings and stick them and fight for every single tenth because every single tenth counts. So hit those handstands and squeeze and just go big. And how does it feel to be the most valuable player for Minnesota tonight? It feels really good, especially on my community day. Um, definitely was working hard in the gym to go out there and contribute really all my stuff for my te uh, team and hit everything. So it felt really good. Did you think of your overall performance tonight? I know that you put up on your best scores of the season, uh, but you still did lose by over four tenths of the points. So what do you think? Well, uh, Penn State is an amazing team. I mean, they're ranked ninth, ninth in the country right now. Um, for us to, to be that close to them, I was pretty excited. They're, uh, you know, they've got some amazing individuals, so I thought we really held our own, which was great. This is the team I know we have, so uh, overall, I was really excited to see them do what they know how to do and get out there with confidence and really focus on what they were trying to accomplish tonight. So overall, I was really, really pleased with them, and, and they were pleased too. Definitely. Um, and then what did you think of all of the girls you had that kind of came out for injury? I know Janelle Campbell and Lucianis competed last week, but they continue to improve, and then right. Shannon Kolich came back for the first time. So how is that, knowing that people are starting to heal and rest up? And well, it's huge, <laughs> um, because we see potential, not only with the, you know, the women that are going to continue spots but also getting those veterans back because the people that are out are veterans so we're looking at kids who are seniors um, juniors so to get Shannon Golich back on beam I mean obviously she's a, she's solid for us um, we're really excited about potentially getting her back on vault next weekend and then floor the weekend after that she's just someone you can count on she's a very good competitor very polished performer and then Janelle also has been doing quite a bit more uh, we changed up her bar routine a little bit today, and uh, obviously she did a phenomenal job, got a great score, stuck her dismount. And then Lucy, I mean Lucy's a senior, and the seniors, you know, they get out there and they, they really know how to perform, and so we're thrilled. And Lucy will, again, also be able to do a little bit more in the gym this week. So we steadily feel our team um, coming to its full capacity. And then, of course, Justine Cherwink is another one that we're looking to add in in about maybe three to four weeks. So we have um, we have a lot to look forward to. Definitely. And then what was uh, Golich's injury again? Was it her hamstring? Right. Um, a quad. Quad. Okay. Yep. Um, and then knowing that this was another like Big Ten team that you competed against, uh, how is that going to kind of like launch you into Big Ten champions that's coming up? Uh, it's nice to see who you're, who you're competing against. Um, the Big Ten is really strong. You know, we get stronger and stronger every year. Now we've added Nebraska, who was, I don't know where they're ranked now, but they were ranked number one last time I checked in the country. So uh, we've got a lot of really great schools. And honestly, we can't really affect what they do. We can only affect what we do. So we're just going to keep focusing on our performance and what we need to do to improve and, and continue to score better.